More than half of Arkansas's rice acres are watered using cascade contour levee systems. Joe Massey, who developed the Multiple Inlet Rice Irrigation, or MIRI, and Alternate Wetting and Drying, or AWD techniques, is now working on a method to save water in more traditional flood irrigations. Massey spoke at the online Arkansas Soil and Water Education Conference. Right on, on I'd say 80% of our fields, our rice acres are in Miri. We have some row rice also. And then uh, we have, you know, 100 acres or so that's cascade flood. Okay. Uh, and there's just by uh, talking with Joe, there's options out there uh, to use besides uh, cascade. So in this particular system, uh, we take a cascade rice uh, field and we're trying to recognize that with the water flowing over the levee gates, of course, you know, you build up this cushion of water that flows down. And we know that farmers have generally tried to, to, to stop that irrigation and kind of time that so that a whole bunch of water doesn't run off the field. With the advent of some of this simple automation, I think it's going to make this uh, uh, ability to better time that cascade flood uh, much easier. And so in this particular setting, an example, we have a 10 patty straight levee field. Again, the model is a simple model, um, but it, it is a tool for us to try to ask questions. Like if we were to put a flood depth sensor in the eighth patty of a 10 patty field and use that flood depth sensor to inform the farmer that, hey, the eighth patty is now full. And that would be the first level of automation. And then the farmer can decide if they want to drive down and turn the well off, or we could have that sensor shut the well off automatically, or if they don't want the field to be shut off, that sensor could control a, a system with auto valves that would rotate to some other field. Again, those are the different levels of automation like we talked about before. But in this ACES concept, uh, we would fill the field patty eight until it's full and then shut the irrigation off. And the next two patties serve as catch basins, and they're going to catch that uh, excess irrigation and uncaptured rainfall to irrigate those bottom two patties, which represent about 25, 20 to 25% of the field area. The other concept is that we would manage those bottom patties using alternate wetting, drying agronomics. 